Hello, I'm Michael Gauntz with the Stationary Work Holding Group here at Shunk USA. I'm in our tech center at Raleigh, North Carolina, and I want to talk to you today about a new product I'm really excited about that we've already had really good success with. Um, and that is our Contec KSC Mini Vice. I want to tell you about a lot of really cool features about this vice, but first let's talk about how do we clamp small work pieces generally in four and five axis applications? So a few techniques come to mind currently. Uh, the first being something like a dovetail. And there's really great advantage to a dovetail, and that's you get great work piece access, and you also have very high clamping forces. So it's a really secure hold and you have great work piece access. The downside is it means you have to prep the material for the first operation, which means you're adding an operation before you can even get in to the machining you really want to do to that component. So that's one option. The second option is using something like wedge clamps. And wedge clamps are a great technique. Uh, I really like them for three and four axis applications because you get very high part density at a relatively low cost. Because the wedge clamps don't cost too much and it means you can load a lot of parts in a small area uh, with minimal investment. And the third technique that comes to mind is to simply use the vice you have. Uh, and that's perfectly okay. You know, maybe you just need to get this part done. You need to figure out a way to make it. But there are many disadvantages of using a vise that's oversized for the workpiece, especially in multi-axis applications, because you start losing accessibility to the workpiece. So now let's take a look at the Contec KSC Mini and why I'm so excited about this, because I think it combines the best of all three worlds. So what makes this vise unique? Well, first of all, like I said, this is our Contec KSC Mini. It's the KSC Mini 70-80. What that means is the width of the vise is 70 millimeters, the length of the vise is 80. We also have this in another configuration that's the 70-100, which means that same width, it's instead 100 millimeters length. So, those are the two options we have for the sizes of the vise. And what you'll notice is how low the profile is. This, is. this is a really cool feature about this vise, is how low the Z height is. And what that means is you're invading minimally into the Z axis travel of the machine, which really sets it apart. So you have a, a, a compact profile, a low height, and in that small compact profile, we really pack a punch with the clamping force. So we have a very efficient spindle design with very tight tolerance fits between the shaft and the bore that the spindle sits in. What that means is that a given input torque, you're creating very high clamp forces. And why is that important? Well, if you need to have really good part access, you need to make sure you're clamping on that part securely. And that's one of the benefits we talked about about dovetail. But with this vise, because you're biting into the material so well, with such an aggressive grip geometry and high forces, it means you don't need to prep the workpiece because the simple clamp is enough to give you uh, a really strong hold on the workpiece. So we've got a compact profile with a very high clamp force. The other thing that sets this vise apart is how easy everything is about it. We have two simple mounting holes on the top side of the vise where you can just simply mount in from the top side, and those are prepared for M6 socket head cap screws. The bottom side, it's already even prepared for the standard 52 millimeter quick change systems that are out on the market today. Additionally, I'm gonna show you this in just a minute, but what's really neat about this is the jaw change doesn't even require any hand tools or clamps. It's simply quick change jaws that come on and off very easily to change between parts, just like that. So why don't we take a look over here and let's talk about some more details about this vise in particular and some of the features and benefits. So here you can just see sampling of different types of jaws that we have with this vise. There's many more options available in the catalog. Um, and you can see first and foremost, we have a 45 millimeter width available of this jaw, as well as a 70 millimeter width. Then, in addition to that, you have the aggressive grip style jaw, a precision ground surface version of this jaw, and machinable soft jaws available all for this vise. 
so we just looked at some of the detail about this vice and particularly what sets this vice apart. Um, what we were primarily looking at is the Contec KSC Mini 70-80. So in this machine, I have the 70-100 version. It's mounted to our VeroOS Quick Change Palette system. And with that, I want to prove to you how much force this, real, this vice really has. So we're going to clamp this workpiece and take a look at the kind of grip we get into it with that vice. So let's take a look. Thank you for watching today as I introduced our new KSC Mini vise available now in stock in North Carolina. We have two sizes available, the KSC Mini 70-80 and the KSC Mini 70-100. Both are sold without the JAWS, which allows you the flexibility to choose the right JAWS for your application. If you'd like more information, you can check out the description below, which has a phone number and email for our stationary work holding group at Shunk USA. Thanks again.